Subscribe to Smartphone Tutorials and hit the notification bell icon to get instant notification. Hey guys, welcome to another video and in today's video, we're going to install AeroOS for the Pocophone F1. This is based on Android 9 Pie. We will quickly install it and have a first look at its features and stuff. And maybe by the end of the video, we'll decide if we want to review it or not. And do remember, every day in the morning at 9 a.m., we do go ahead and upload a new video. That is a premiere that happens. You can chat with me there. So before we do all of that, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a video. At the same time, here's a card to my second channel that is Kratos390. Go ahead and check that channel out as well. Now without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. All right guys, so welcome to another install and preview for the Pocophone F1. In today's video, we're going to install Aero OS for the Pocophone F1. And usual set of disclaimers, you need to have more than 50% battery, make sure all your data is backed up, and you need to have an unlocked bootloader with TWRP installed. As always, you will need four files. You will need the firmware vendor, you will need the ROM, Google Apps, and disable force encryption which will ensure that your phone stays decrypted and you install Majesk root as well. As always, to start off, we will go to wipe, advanced wipe, Dalvik cache system data, swipe to wipe, go to the home screen, go to install, start queuing your files. So first we will queue the Beryllium vendor and then the ROM file and then open Google Apps and the last file will be disabled force encryption. Four files are queued, so swipe to confirm flash now this flash will take anywhere between five to seven minutes so please be very very patient while that happens all right now as you can see over here everything has been flashed so we will go to reboot system do not install wait for the phone to boot up now the first boot will take anywhere between two to three minutes and we will also have a look at the beautiful boot animation for Aero OS. And as always, it is very normal for the phone to reboot once from halfway of the boot animation. If you have installed Majisk, don't worry. Second time, it will complete the boot. And to me, this looks like one of the most beautiful and one of the most fascinating boot animations. Let's wait for the phone to boot up and then we will enter the system and have a look at this beautiful OS. All right, so we are on the home screen and we are all set up and the wallpaper and the blackness of the ROM does tell me that it does have a black theme and that is absolutely right. So this is Android version 9, Android security patch is June 2019. Now if we go to the settings menu over here and see it is sort of a dark grey sort of a theme, it's not a completely black theme and if we swipe to the left over here we don't have the Google Now integration. Let's actually go to home settings over here. And it does say enable Google feed integration. Yes, it is there. It was just disabled. And if we have a look, we have very, very few limited number of applications. And the camera over here is the basic camera which is supplied with all the custom ROMs. And I'm pretty sure voice over LT is working fine. So let's make a call on the support helpline. There you go. So voice over LT is working. You can definitely, and I do have this uh, pixel -esque animation over here so that really really adds up to it and if we talk about the smoothness it is very very fluid and very very smooth a lot of you guys have been telling me spend more time with the rom spend more time with the rom guys this is an install and preview i will just be giving you a gist a preview of what is going to come in the full review when i use it because the moment i install it just talking about some features and stuff and i give you a full review which is completely not true doesn't really make sense i actually believe in using the rom as a personal daily driver and giving you a score which will then tell you you should use it or not in a true opinion. So we do have button customization over here and uh, do we have a specific customization? No. We do have digital well-being. Well, guess that works just fine. Apart from that, we have apps and notifications, display. So if you go to display over here, okay, I have a sort of a freeze over here. All right. So I don't know why that was happening, but uh, oh, okay. So you do have a lot of customization in display. You do have ambient display. You can turn it on or turn it off. And advanced settings, you do have an enable option to, while picking it up, you want it to be enabled or not. So let's actually have a look. There you go. So ambient display does work. That is a very, very good thing. 
apart from that uh, you do have some customization in other options as well for example if you go to buttons over here there you go you have pixel navbar animation you can enable or disable 100 mode playback control reorient the buttons there you go the buttons should be reorienting when I click on this but that's not happening so that is the reason you know I don't give you guys a full full review in the first go of install and preview as well I did have a couple of hiccups when it comes to error OS in this install and preview so I will hold back until a couple of more builds come out or, and I use it as a daily driver so that I can review it but from the first impressions if you want to give this a try you can definitely do that this is not a broken ROM it's an amazing ROM they have been in the custom ROM scenario for a very very long time this rom does get a thumbs up from me let me know in the comment section how much would you score this rom out of 10 and based on that i will be doing a full rom review as well let me know how did you like this video please please give this video a like because it really really helps this channel a lot and it doesn't cost you anything until the next one this is kalash signing off with smartphone tutorials keep smiling take care goodbye